Hey everyone, are you a freelancer looking to level up your game? Today we are diving into TopTal, a freelancing platform unlike any other. Forget the race to bottom on Upwork and Fiverr. TopTal is like the Harvard of freelancing. Super selective, super uh, prestigious and potentially super rewarding. And guys, by any chance, if you are really interested in my preferred way to make around $5,000 to $10,000 every month from comfort of your home, just by making use of your computer and internet connection, then please visit the first link in the description, get registered and watch my masterclass. Just imagine if an ordinary person like me who can sit at home and make money in dollars just by creating these kinds of automated systems worth thousands of dollars. Why can't you do the same and start making money for your success? Now the question is, is TopTal legit? You bet. They connect freelancers with top companies like Shopify, Motorola and many more. But here is the catch. They only accept the top 3% of applicants. That means you got to be an absolute expert in your field. So how does it work? First, you apply as a freelancer in one of their five categories developer, designer, finance with management consultant or project manager. Each category has subcategories too, so you can showcase your niche expertise. Now brace yourself, you know top tall screening process is intense and it can take weeks of assignments and interviews. But if you make it through, you are golden. Top tall connects you with high paying long term projects. We are talking serious money here. The average freelancer pulls in around $88,000 a year. Now let's break down the pros and cons of uh, TopTal. You know, uh, TopTal attracts high paying clients because of their uh, rigorous waiting process. You can ditch uh, the low ball offers and command your worth. Having clients like Shopify and Bridgestone on your resume, now that's impressive. TopTal gigs boost your credibility and open doors to future opportunities. Forget the stress of uh, undercutting your rates. You know, TopTal assigns freelancers to projects based on skill set, so you get paid what you're worth. Both freelancers and clients go through a screening process. This means you'll be working with serious businesses that value your expertise. But of course, you know, there are some cons to consider. You know, the application process is long and demanding and be prepared to showcase your top skills and experience with evidence to back it up. And TopTal focus on a few specific fields. If your skill fall outside the categories, then you're out of luck. Even after you get accepted, it takes time to build a reputation and land projects. You know here, patience is key. So guys, by any chance, if you are really interested in my preferred way uh, to make around $5,000 to $10,000 every month from comfort of your home, then I request you to please visit the first link in the description, get registered and watch the complete presentation. And as I said, if a normal Indian person like me who can sit at home and make money in dollars just by creating these automated systems, why can't you do the same? All right. So now the question is, is top tall right for you? If you are a highly skilled freelancer who wants to work with top tier clients and uh, earn top dollars, then absolutely. So head over to Glassdoor and see what other freelancers are saying. But if you are new to freelancing or uh, your skill don't fit their categories, then there might be better platforms to start with. As I said, please visit the first link and get registered. Ultimately, you know, TopTall is a fantastic platform for the top talent. If you think uh, you have what it takes, go for it and it could be your ticket to freelancing success. And guys, if you're watching this video for the first time, then please do subscribe. Why? Because on this channel, I've reviewed uh, hundreds and hundreds of different ways to make money online. Some are great and others are complete waste of time. So if you do subscribe, then please don't forget to hit that notification bell. Why? Because it would be motivating me to create new content as well as you get notified if I drop any new video on my channel. That's it for today. Hope you like this video and uh, meet you in my next video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.